Welcome to my doctor for emergency contraceptive store. <clears throat> um, here, we need to know uh, what does this drug do to our bodies? How does it help us? How does it benefit us? And what are the risks that we normally face? The biggest benefit that we have from this drug is preventing conception. And this we normally use to prevent conception in an emergency. But we should avoid using the emergency contraceptives as family planning because they are not part of family planning. Well, uh, some people complain. They use the drug and sometimes get pregnant. Well, let's look at what the drug does to the body. The drug normally prevents all half hormones and we know that we all have eggs from our ovaries and this egg passes to the tubes where it has to get fertilized. The process we call ovulation. Well, the drug prevents this process. The drug prevents the process of passing the egg from your ovary to the tubes where it can, where it can get fertilized. However, if you swallow the drug or if you play sex when you are so fertile, that is like 12 days uh, from 12 days or 10, 12 to 10 days from the day you last saw your menstrual periods. You are so fertile in this time. And when you play sex, sometimes when you use the drug, it may not, it may not work for you. Why? Because you are so fertile. You have already ovulated. Well, sometimes the drug can cause what is called hormonal imbalances. Hormonal imbalances to us. These are the risks in most of the cases. Where someone can get a uh, uterine bleeding, someone, you, you may begin getting uh, uterine bleeding, or you may have uh, uh, a dysfunction, we call it a dysfunction in your periods, uh, in your periods, where you can have your periods changing days from the normal. Sometimes you can have uh, problems with uh, you, may, you, may get, you may begin getting low, uh, low abdominal pains and so many others. These are because of the, this is because of the hormonal imbalances that we normally get. Now, <coughs> ladies should know that you should, pre you should avoid using the drug so much. Especially, do not use the drug beyond three times. Beyond three times in one monthly cycle. In one monthly cycle or in, or in one month. Do not use the drug beyond three times. Uh, that is what I had for you. Do not forget to subscribe uh, to my doctor and uh, do not forget uh, to like our, pay, uh, our channel. Um, watch or uh, stay tuned for the next videos as we shall be taking, taking you through and talking about your reproductive health. Thank you.